Hey, what is up, everybody? My name is Rahul, and in this video, I shall be giving you a quick walkthrough of two of the challenges that were a part of the SecureWorks CTF challenge. So both of them are going to be from the forensics category with levels easy and medium. So the first one that we'll be talking about is called misplaced. All this challenge does is that it provides us with a file. The name of the file is called file.wat. So let's run a couple of tests to find out what this file is. Let's run it using file. So as you can see, it just gives us that it is data. Let's see strings. So as you can see, there's nothing much. Now let's check if this file is a PNG or a JPEG file. So for checking if this file is a PNG file, we'll have to check for headers essentially. So one of the headers is called IHDR, second is IDAT and IEND. So if there is a presence of IHDR, IDAT or IEND, this can tell you that the file is a PNG file. So let's check if this is a PNG file. So as you can see, there's nothing being thrown out. So at this point of time, the only option that I was left with is using a tool called Foremost. So Foremost is a essential tool in these cases where you actually don't know what the file has. So let's use Foremost file.bot. So as you can see, after processing, it found a file called article.jpg. So let's see, there's a folder by the name of output that it created. Let's cd into it. As you can see, there's an edit file and a zip folder. So let's cd into zip. Let's unzip it. As you can see, it shows that the archive is this and it is also showing us the name of the file, which is article.jpg and the password to the file. This means that the zip file is password protected and we'll have to unzip it using this password. So I'll be manually going to the folder and unzipping it over there as it is not being supported over here. So this is the file, let's extract it. Let's extract it in the same folder itself. Let's paste in the password and there it is. This is the file that has been extracted, article1.jpg. Now let's eog article. Okay, so apparently there's an error in the file. Let's use file article. As you can see that it is a Microsoft Word 2007 document and its extension has been changed. So let's manually change in the extension .docx and now let's open it up in document. So if you can see the first part, it says that file craving. So foremost is the tool which uses file craving technique to find out the embedded data. So towards the end of the file, we are provided with the flag of the challenge. So now that we are done with it, let's solve the second challenge. The name of the challenge was called nice duck. All it does is provide us with a duck.pcap file. So let's cd into the folder. So this is the file that it provided us with. So let's use Wireshark to see the file. Now there isn't much over here. So the first thing that I normally do is go to file and export objects and try all these four options. Nothing over here. Let's, let's go with HTTP this time. As you can see, there are a couple of videos and text files that we can extract. So let's use save all and save it in the same folder itself. Now that it has been saved, let's examine it one by one. Let's go to the folder. And as you can see, these are the files. Nothing here. Let's check the source code. Nothing over here. Let's check for another file. Okay, so this is a file with the username and password. We don't need it. So it says that there is a file by the name of flag.png. If I click on it, there's nothing that is displayed. So if I control U,
again there's nothing over here so at this point of time the only option that was left to me was check the video files so this looks quite small as it is 7.7 .7 kb let's try this one so this was the duck that was being referred to and if you wait for the moment this is it this is the flag to the challenge so thank you guys this is it for the video i hope you liked it if this was of some help to you please make sure that you click on the like button and subscribe to my channel thank you